Hello, I'm Mike Stoika, and this is just a standalone Minecraft Rex360 video. And I want to talk about YouTube because a lot of people ask me this. This is something I'd rather usually not talk about. Uh, but a lot of people seem to ask me, like, uh, what, what's the tip to doing well on YouTube? What's the big secret formula? Because they seem to think that, like, uh, everyone that has more than, I don't know, let's say, pff, it's like 10 subscribers, has a secret tips and tricks. Because how would you get that many? Oh, I have no idea. Uh, but a lot of people ask me this, so I figure I'll just make a video on it. Because, honestly, I watch so many videos that are like, uh, so the best way to get famous on YouTube is to and then they use some really bad technique like uh, to get a shout out or something and I don't know I, I'd like to put in my two cents into the hat even though I live in the UK and use British currency but whatever um, <laughs> that's not really relevant at all so anyway let's just start with why should you uh, when you're starting YouTube we'll just start there uh, first of all don't start YouTube if you don't think you can make it okay don't start YouTube let's just start the reason why you shouldn't start YouTube don't start YouTube for money first of all it's not really a good way to make money. There's this, there's the super success stories. There's uh, like there's Toby Games and there's the and the Syndicate and there's I don't know the Yogs Cast that make their many many millions. Um, well, it's not really many millions. It's they, even the very top of success. Like if you are the very best and you got lucky and a combination of factors, it's still only like just over a million for the Yogs Cast. Uh, I'm not Syndicate himself unless he's got a spe uh, special CPM deal from a Shinma won't have even had a million yet. So we're we're talking like in not really like super high numbers here. So first of all, consider that don't don't make videos for money because first of all, the p fact that you're not passionate will show. You won't be you won't upload regularly because you just won't care. Um, that sort of stuff. It's just it's just not a smart thing to do. But in my opinion. Um, and even if you do get super successful, it's not the best plan. And you might be thinking, wait, I'd like a million. But that's the very top. Like, uh, even even with, uh, like, okay, so think of it just uh, this way. Like, if you're getting 100,000 views a month, which is where I'm at, that's still, uh, like, I could get a job uh, work, like, a quarter of the hours and still get paid more. So, you know, if you want to do money, just get a job or something. Work your way up the career ladder. <laughs> I don't know what people do for money these days. But honestly, better shot sure making it. Um... Because, uh, okay, second of all, why should you start YouTube? If you look at someone's videos, like, uh, I, I remember this is actually something from Philip DeFanco, who's one of the few YouTubers who actually, you know, I, I think, wow, what, what a good guy, he's doing it right. Um, just look at, ooh, gold, um, but just look at someone who's doing YouTube and, you know, if they're, like, doing something that you think you can improve on, uh, and you think it would be enough that people would be like, yeah, I think I'd watch that, then, then that's a good, you know, way to start a YouTube channel. Obviously, you have to care as well, but, um, and even if, okay, even if you don't think you can add something and you really care about gaming, then I guess you could, but you need to have an edge to yourself, like, uh, even if you are less, uh, I'm not going to use myself as an example because I don't like to pretend I'm super good at YouTube, in fact I'm not, I've, I'm like ranked 66 out in the world, so you could argue I'm not the best to be giving tips here, but let's just uh, continue anyway, uh, so let's say you, I don't know, you're just as good as the, you're equally as good as the uh, Yogs cast, uh, and you made YouTube videos, you would not get like a tenth of what they have, because it's it's not that simple. You have to be better uh, than that. It's it's sort of like how our products work in a marketplace. Like um, if you are an alter if the equal to McDonald's, you still would not do as good as McDonald's because you wouldn't, you wouldn't do as temp as good as McDonald's because there's a variety of reasons why I succeed. Quality is the most important one, but it's not everything. So first of all, you need to add like something really massive to the table uh, to even begin to start doing good. Um, so yeah, just going to say that one now. Um, and also, uh, something you shouldn't ever focus on is... Uh, okay, now let's uh, just actually let's just go into ways to get big or whatever. Um, new games. New games are a big, big factor. Um, when a new game comes out, that's your chance to show the world. Uh, because you should, you should start working on your content before a big game. Like, for instance, you could work on... Like, if you, if you start making Minecraft X360 like, videos now, you're probably not going to get anywhere. If you start making Minecraft PC videos, probably not going to get anywhere. But when the new PC updates come out, that's your chance to show the world yourself. But if you're then really bad, it's not going to do anything. So that's, that's my opinion as far as that goes. Um... So yeah, that's uh, just make good content. Like I don't know how to really say more than that. But if it's something you feel, feel people aren't doing gaming, uh, then you know do that. Also, don't you don't necessarily have to do gaming if you if you want to do YouTube because you like the aspect of uh, I don't know showing yourself off to the world. <laughs> that sounds really strange, but I guess that's some people are probably into that. Um, 
then uh, you know, just do that. Like, uh, start a vlogging channel, maybe, or you know, try and find something new and innovative that people would that you'd like to watch, uh, and then there's a good chance that people want to watch it if you know you would. Uh. But yeah, that's 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 as far as content goes. Now let's just go into the how to get your stuff out there, uh, because that's the that's the side where I have a really strong opinion. Um, First of all, never spam people. Um, okay, so if you ever spam someone or do one of those silly things, such as uh, back in the day it used to be like, leave comments on people's channels saying, yeah, I like your videos too, man, you're really good. Um, that would, uh, that was like, the, you know, the spam of its day. Now it's gone so much worse, like comments are just filled with it. Uh, it's it's really bad, I don't like it. Um, but yeah, that's, that's what it used to be back in the day, and... Um, Basically, this guy on my channel, he uh, he left a, like one of those, and now he's got like over a hundred thousand subscribers. Oh, I'll, I'll just name him anyway because I doubt it will do anything. Uh, but he was like called the Ozorek YT, and uh, that just that's that will always be against you. Like when people look at you, they'll be like, "Wow, you did that." So I oh, know I'm just gonna say that one now, to let you be aware of the, I guess the risks, the downsides of uh, doing bad things. I would strongly not recommend it. it just there's just no point. Um, and if you are going to do it, if you really want to do that comment spam thing because you feel it's the only way, first of all, you're not going to get anywhere, like maybe one in every thousand comments will get someone to even check out your channel, and uh, you'll get like fifth, you'll get loads of dislikes in the meantime because uh, that's what most people do. <laughs> they find people who are spamming, be like, just let's uh, discourage this guy, then they'll go and dislike all the videos. I've seen it happen quite a few times, it's uh, a little upsetting. Um, but you know that's just uh, it's the risk you run. So I wouldn't recommend doing it. But if you're gonna do it, then uh, channels such as Machinima, uh, oh, I'm probably not allowed to say that. Um, <laughs> but yeah, channels such as Machinima are probably the best place to go because ooh slime. Uh, so I'm gonna use my fist so I don't accidentally ooh. Where did that slime spawn? Sorry, question for another day. Um. But yeah, uh, so if you're gonna spam your channel, use the big channels such that aren't moderated by like the owner, because people you know that own their own channels, all of it, uh, such as myself. Nah, it pisses me off a little uh, when someone does that, and it's probably gonna remove. Well, I'm, I'm gonna remove your comment, and it's not gonna even gonna be seen by many people. Whereas on a channel like Machinima, if they do moderate their comments, which I don't know if they do, uh, then that's where it's done. But don't do it like that. that. Also, uh, in a video I watched, it said something like "Go on, Omegle and tell people to." watch your channel no I the best way to do it make when a new game comes out try and get the hot keywords uh, hopefully we get a few like you know 10,000 view videos uh, or like even a thousand view videos uh, will help build that subscribe account but you need you need some views coming into your channel really and uh, when a new game comes out try and make the best content you can try and you know word it the best like uh, for instance I have some uh, black ops 2 chicken CQB gameplay that's on like 5,000 views now um, uh, when Black Ops 1 came out, I had some. St I played one of every uh, wager mode. That was before I did commentary, so that didn't do that well. But you know, there's still like 10,000 eyes on the channel. Um, even like with a 1% subscribe rate, that's like 100. Uh, that's definitely just a good way to do it. Not that I'm saying just buy new games. But if, when there's a new game that fits your genre, uh, do that. That's that's how I'd recommend you do it. Like that's how all the big guys do it. Like, uh, well, actually, how the big guys do it is they were just first to the big game now. But you know, when there's a new game coming out and you know it's probably gonna be big or a new update for Minecraft, something like that, uh, just try your best to make your best content and phrase it well. Uh, or you know, make the title well, like yeah, Black Ops 2 multiplayer gameplay. Oh well, that's that's how I'd recommend you do it. That's how you do it. Like um, that's the legitimate way, anyway. Uh, there's other ways, but I wouldn't recommend it. Just just do that. Um, or you, or you know, even if you just sit there making content on an old game, you can still get recognised. Uh, it's just you know, if you're if you're making good content, don't worry about all this other stuff. That's what I'm saying. Focus on content 99% of the time would be my recommendation. Um, so that's pretty much all my tips and tricks. Uh, one thing I will say, just if you are planning to do this whole YouTube malarkey, I'm going to say malarkey because it's not really a thing. Um, Make sure you get with a good network. Uh, the amount of channels that I see that are really big and they're with Machinima, and I'm like, ha, sucks to be them, really, doesn't it? Um, not that I'm, I probably shouldn't say that. Uh, probably could, oh, no, I'm not going to bother. Uh, but yeah, it's not that I'm saying Machinima's bad, but they, you you need to research your networks, you know, blip, work out if you're cool where they are on the pay grades, because like network like Machinima, they actually pay a considerable amount less. Uh, well, it's variable, but it's, it's, a, it's a whole other big deal. But basically, they pay a whole lot less than 
like uh, TGS or, you know, the other ones, for instance. So, you know, just going to say that one now. Uh, I'm not going to go any more in depth in that because I don't want to burn any bridges. Uh, but, yeah, that's pretty much all my YouTube tips and tricks. Uh, it's my usual little talking thing of, like, um, not completely going straight to the point and going around it a bit. But hopefully something I said in there helped you out. Um, also, uh, just a few more random things I want to throw in there. Um, don't, uh, don't, don't spam, uh, whatever. Um, also, titles of the videos, I was going to just go on my don't spam thing. But I've, I've said that, and honestly, I could, I've, okay, just I want to quickly clear myself now. I've never spammed, uh, I think I did sub, uh, sub for sub, if you know what that is, for the first 50 subscribers. Um, but I think that's the worst I've ever done. Um, <laughs> I think I think they all unsubscribe now anyway. So that's that makes me a little happier that my subscribe because uh, like honestly, all that would do is like lower your subscribe to view numbers, which isn't really good. Um, oh, and when you are a small channel, make sure you give yourself a sense of uniqueness that you. Don't like go with the I'm the smallest channel on YouTube or whatever because that will bite you in the ass uh, <laughs> some way down the line. But like go with like um, actually go with something that like. Uh, like, don't just pretend you're a big channel when you're a small channel. Like, let's go for 20 likes. That's just silly. Just just focus on the content when you're small. Um, also, when you have an intro or something, just don't don't just steal a big YouTube intro. Like, hello, ladies and gentlemen, or, <laughs> or whatever. Of I didn't even know any other big YouTubes, but just don't do that. Um, so that's pretty much everything. Uh, there's probably a few more. Like, that's, that's the problem with doing commentaries, just freehand and just talking and doing stuff. I probably missed something. Uh, but that's, for the most part, my guide to YouTube and doing well on YouTube. Uh, guide to making money on YouTube. Don't do YouTube. Get a real job. It's Honestly, it'll pay better. Uh, also, just uh, I might I need to do a whole other video on ra uh, networks because there is they piss me off so much, and I know it's the tiniest thing, but uh, um, yeah, seriously, good networks, good uh, focus on content because if you have good content, then everything else will follow. Um, which I, I I hate saying that because it's uh, I, yeah, it's just it's just the way to go forward. Like put production value in there. Uh, the two things you want to focus on if you're doing gameplay: get good gameplay. Uh, for Minecraft, that's not really too applicable. Uh, but you know, maybe if you're good at building stuff and you build stuff to make people go, "Wow, that's really a plus to your channel." Uh, <laughs> I don't really do that. I just sort of build things that confuse people. But yeah, if you can if you can get good gameplay, definite plus. If you can get good quality, definite plus. Uh, oh yeah, just. Uh, you're going to need to invest a lot. You probably won't get it back. That's something you should know as soon as you start YouTube. So if unless you have a really good idea, just just be willing to lose money. Um, so I think that's just about everything I have to say. Um, hopefully I helped someone out uh, Someone out there out. Um, would be nice to know if I did. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much everything I have to say. What? Wait, what? Hmm. I'd... I don't know. I've clearly been here before. I'll get the eye out while I'm here. Uh, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed this uh, little standalone video. I'm just going to do, like, a, as I said, standalone video for the first time, I think, like, ever. Uh, just because I, I want to see how it does. Um, it's an interesting topic. Lots of people ask me about it. So hopefully I answered you. Um, but yeah, that's all I really have to say for now. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, it'd be great if you did. Where am I? Where's this staircase lead to? I'm I'm really curious. I'm gonna just quickly. Sorry, let me just. Uh, <laughs> no, okay, this just leads to. Oh, uh, but, <laughs> this was a just standalone video. I hope you enjoyed it. Like it if you like YouTube. Um, I really have to make good those. Um, hopefully I taught you something in there somewhere. Uh, thanks for watching, and most importantly, goodbye.